In this video, we see how far we can push you. It's Da Vinci time. I like to put solar to good use. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna test this fan so that you can like run it at night after it's been charged up by the sun during the day. So let's give it a go. That works perfectly. This particular fan is uh, 45 watts uh, on maximum setting. So if you have it on its lowest setting, which is about 25 to 30 watts, you might get almost a full night's cooling in your bedroom just from this battery charge or from the sun. Okay, so the battery's on. Uh, we're gonna give it a go for our shredder test. So I thought we'd push this uh, battery to see how far it goes and you don't have to do that. So what I've got in here is a standard Bosch uh, grass trimmer. So we're just going to give this a go uh, and see whether this works. Hopefully the battery survives and um, we'll see if it can actually do any trimming even though I haven't got much to do. Let's give it a go. I wasn't expecting it to work, but it did. Time to push the battery uh, further again. So we're gonna have a look at this hedge trimmer here from Black & Becker and see whether we can uh, get it to work with the battery and again, on purely on free solar energy. Again, I'm doing this so you don't have to push your battery this far. So let's see how it goes. Now, unfortunately, lot that one didn't work. Not quite enough juice to push this particular strimmer. Okay, now it's time for the most extreme test, as you can see. Uh, this is a 1700 watt electric lawnmower from Bosch. Um, I'm not holding out much hope for this one because it's going way, way, way over the spec of the battery. So uh, let's give it a push and see what it does. Conclusive proof that I think we've reached the maximum limit of this battery, even though it has a 350 watt inverter with a 500 watt peak. Um, this, <laughs> this is way over what it could do, but it's worth a try, so it's a thumbs down for this one. So it's time to test whether free solar energy can keep you cool during the day or at night. Uh, this is a 55 watt uh, pedestal fan as you can see so we're going to test it on all three settings and just see how it gets on We 
hope you liked our video, all the links you'll need will be in the description below. Please like, share, subscribe and hit the bell icon and stay tuned to Da Vinci.